my goodness, my hair, it's all messy. Okay, welcome to another vlog. Guess what? You're not gonna believe this. Getting my camera fixed. I'm actually gonna go drop it off at Best Buy today. And I'm like, wait, how am I gonna do a Vlogmas if my camera goes into the shop? Marla has been using a different camera for her filming and so she is loaning me her vlog camera. I didn't even think about it. Anyway, I asked her, I'm like, are you even using it? I noticed you're vlogging on a different camera. So she's like, yeah, I'm not even using mine. So, I mean, not right now at least. So I am using, but she has cracks all over her screen. She needs to get hers fixed too. I am trying to upload as much as possible, you guys. I had the sweetest person say, I had said something on Instagram. Here's my Instagram channel. It's also down below. I had somebody, I had put that I was gonna do Vlogmas, but I'm joking around calling it some miss because I'm really just vlogging some more. So the normal. <laughs> I'm not doing the everyday vlogging, I just, ugh. anyway. But I had said I was concerned because I don't want to bore people. And this person like DM'd me right away and they're like, you are never boring, which, okay, I'm sorry. That's, that cannot be true. <laughs> But I thought it was so so sweet and it meant so much to me that it made me want to pick up the camera and keep vlogging so Hopefully you guys are enjoying these vlogs. Yeah, that's pretty much it I feel like I owe it to you guys to really show how badly broken my camera is like I'm not joking around like it's hanging I think that's like a like it's more than a thread But it like seems like a piece of material that it's hanging by there used to be two screws like one right there and one right there yeah, so when I would vlog, I would literally hold, by the way, I have that sticker on because Marla and I have the exact same camera. So often I'd pick up her camera and vlog and she'd be vlogging on mine. And then it would just be, it would be confusing on whose footage was whose. But anyway, so I would vlog and I would have to hold it like this. Obviously, clearly it's broken. Yeah, hopefully they can fix it. Hopefully I don't have to buy a whole brand new one, but we'll see what happens. I just would never. No, I would if I would like weighed 100 pounds, maybe. But this makes me feel like a snow beast. This is actually Marla's, but she was like, mom, try it on. They just left to go film a video, but I'm like, I'm not gonna wear this. Besides, I think it makes me look like Ralphie. This looks like your fur, huh? Doesn't it? Okay, so right now I think I'm gonna go I am not done. I've done a lot of online shopping and I think I'm gonna do some more online shopping. There's just a few things that I do need to go and get. He's loving this. Yes, you are. Anyway, as far as the jacket though, in all honesty, I think it's a really cute color. It's just too like thick and bulky. It's just not for me. And I'll have to see who makes it. I know they just did a video on it. Oh, Amazon guy is here. Can you guys see that? See the Amazon truck? Are you gonna start barking? Me and you are gonna go on a walk when I get back, okay? I literally walk him every day. I mean, unless there's really bad weather. Okay, here it comes. Let's see if you're gonna do your barking. Sometimes he barks and sometimes he just doesn't. Ralphie, settle down. My husband likes that he barks like that because he's like, it's a warning. You know, what if someone bad was coming to the door? Thank you. Oh my goodness. It's my husband's Christmas gift and it's not even wrapped. Who would have known? Good thing I got it, not him. Literally, um, let's just say I've bought several of these brushes for gifts and there's no link or anything. It is on Amazon if you guys want to go check it out. They're like the best brushes. I am really picky and I love, love, love these brushes. So that's what just came. Cover that up. That's my husband's gift that came also. Not sure what this is. I got to open that up. And I thought I would just show you who makes this jacket. Totally not sponsored. Just show you because I know some of you might get curious. Just fab and that's why it was so tight on me. It's a size small. I mean, it is cute. It's just, oh, like I said, I think it's just not for me. And then this was the other thing. These are the false eyelashes that I wear, and this is the glue that I used. So, yeah, that's what just came in the mail. Oh my goodness, that's like perfect. So I'm eating some buttered pasta, 
it just sounded really good. I like to be done eating early in the day because of my digestion. It just works so much better. I feel better when I go to bed, so I thought I would just like eat this meal and be done. So traditionally, my family um, during the week, I mean, obviously I prepare food for Amanda or I'll make something up for her for dinner or I'll help her or she'll just warm something up, but everyone kind of just fends for themselves, except for on Sundays. It's tradition that we eat family dinner together on Sundays, but obviously like on holidays and I don't know, just there are times that I don't eat this early. Ideal time for me is like between one and two to stop eating. That is just for me. I'm a grown woman. I'm not advocating everybody to do that. I'm saying for me, for my body, for my health. Anyway, I'm just gonna eat this. It's just like I said, butter noodles. Um, they're really good. I don't like eating on camera. I think I gross people out with noises. Some people don't care. Some people care. So if you really do care, like don't even watch this part. But I'll tell you, these are really good noodles. I just posted a video today and I feel like I'm getting a lot. You know what it is? I feel like my channel gets a lot of love. Didn't know if I had a noodle on my hand. I feel like my channel gets a lot of love in general, but I just, I don't know. I just feel like there's so many nice comments on there and I never take any of them for granted. Overall, I feel like I get a lot of love on my channel and I just wanna say thank you. If you are those people who are giving me lots of love, thank you. I know soda's not that good for me. I probably won't even finish this whole can. It's a baby can. It's one of those mini Diet Pepsis, but just sounds good right now. I'm supposed to pick up the carpool kids here in just a little bit. I'm like, I really don't have much time to run my errands, so I might have to run them afterwards. Or Sam said he would go. Are you done with your food? Yeah? You're all done? Good boy. Sam said he would pick up the kids for me. So, I mean, I'm sure I'll take them up on that, but I thought, oh, I'll just eat first, then go run my errands. I actually don't eat a lot of pasta. I don't, maybe on Sundays for like our Sunday dinner, I'll make pasta sometimes or during the week, like once during the week, but I'm not a big pasta eater. It's sounding really good to me. It's been sounding good to me. So this is tasting really good too. You just hanging out over there? I'm gonna take him for a walk. I've told you that already. Weather's pretty good. What is the weather? Oh my, it's 37 degrees right now. <laughs> First it said 19, that's why I said oh my, but that's what it was this morning. But it's 37 degrees. Marla made these shelled mac and cheese. I think they were from a health food store. Let me see if I can find the box. Ta-da! Not sponsored, but thought I would show you. This is what I'm eating that's mixed in my noodles. And I did find this from the trash can. I'll go wash my hands. It's quiet around here today because Oliver's at work. Evelyn and Marla are off filming. Amanda's at school. Marla's doing the hybrid. They have school off one day a week. They go every other day. So it feels like she's not going to school, but she is. Sam starts BYU in January. So he's downstairs right now just doing his thing. And then, like I said, he's gonna help me later with picking up Amanda. And then Nathan, he's not here very much. He mostly comes just on Sundays. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm getting full. I think I've eaten like half. Okay, I just got back from running errands and didn't finish them all, but that's okay. Come on. Uh, Amanda's reading right now. The girls. Good right out here. Hold on, Ralphie. The girls are still gone and um, off filming. And then I have to go head over to Best Buy. Is Rocky out to play? Let's take, hold on, hold on. Let's take this off. gonna play? Is Rocky home? I just text my friend to see if her dog can play, but I, I haven't heard from her yet. You wanna go play? Okay, let's go play. Come on. We let him off at this part to play because he gets to run. He goes again. He won't go very far. See, he came back. I told him to go up the hill. There's a little dog friend up there. He likes to sniff the gate. He's never played with him though. Amanda might meet me here. She said she would finish her reading and maybe she'll come. If not, that's fine. We don't have very long. It's like 3.40 and I've got to leave here in like 20 minutes. Oh, maybe that's my friend. Okay, that was her. She's, I think she's going to bring out her, her doggy. He's actually the same age as Ralphie. I think they're just like a month apart. I'm gonna get a little winded because I'm going uphill. Me and the kids like to come to this hill and do it like, okay, we'll challenge each other to do it five times or 10 times going up and down it. <gasps> there you are.
question marks with broken hearts I went home my life without you Something right could be so wrong Carry on cause I know I have to let you go Okay, I just got back from the walk. Amanda didn't meet me. Did you do your reading and stuff? Yeah, I did. My okay. Reading. Well, good. Okay. Um, I'm going to Best Buy to get my camera fixed. Okay. Well, well, we'll good. Yeah, we'll see. I've got this is Marla's okay. camera, so she's like, you can use mine. Yeah, I'm gonna go head over. That was good. He had so much fun with Rocky. Really? Oh yeah. my goodness, he ran like as if it was two. Two walks, two worth of walks, if that makes sense. So, okay, I better go or I'm gonna be late and I'll keep you up to date what they said about my camera. Okay, quick update. Um, my warranty expired like three or four months ago. He said about, yeah, three or four months ago, which is fine. I am prepared to buy another camera if I need to. They won't even fix the camera because it's out of warranty. It's either, and we have literally, we have, I have a story to tell you, but I'll keep it very, very short. We have a very hard time finding anybody that fixes G7X cameras. In fact, we haven't found. We found one person a couple years ago and he stole our camera. He was like this like guy that worked out of his house. It was the only guy that we could find and it wasn't even close to our house. It was like an hour away. We delivered it. We like kept calling him like, like after a week or two and then another couple of weeks and then he would never answer his calls and one time we even showed up and it was just so risky we were like we felt like we weren't in a good situation and he answered his like office shop in the back and we should have called the cops or reported him we just we never did i believe we gave him a bad review but on for his business yeah he still has our camera to this day that was that hope that was short enough <laughs> but I'm just gonna hold off and see if maybe they go on sale because there's the Mark III. I have the Mark II. So I think I'll just wait till after Christmas sales is what I'm thinking is probably gonna be my best option. And in the meanwhile, just use Marla's camera. Okay, I'm gonna go into Ulta right now and try to find some stocking stuffers for the girls. Okay guys, I went, okay, I didn't go into Ulta. <laughs> I went into that place called Coming Home and I got a few Christmas ornaments. Look who met me. Dun, dun, dun. Totally surprised me. I remember, I remember you had an appointment in the area, so I thought, wait, I wonder if she's done or about there. So I was driving home and I thought, I'll just pull over and see if she's here. So I called you and you said, oh, I'm here still. So I thought I'd surprise you. Well, that was good timing because he was coming home from work and then, yeah, so that was a nice surprise. And I got some nice little ornaments for the actual tree that we're gonna get eventually. Should we try to go tonight or should we go on Saturday? We can go tonight. Yeah, I'm just so tired. Oh. <laughs> I don't know, Evelyn and I might walk the off more, later. The more we move, the better, easier. I know. Is. 